What is that? What is this noise? of masks where we unbox and review cool stuff almost every single day and I have no idea who gave me a bullhorn but I love it. In today's video we are going to be taking a look at something that is very seldom seen on the channel if you can't tell already by the title and the thumbnail we are doing a Jason slash Friday the 13th unboxing. As I mentioned these are far and few between. I don't really know why because obviously I love horror just as much as I love theatrical music but somehow we just end up doing theatrical music related stuff all the time and it seems like some of the horror artists are just a little more standoffish towards me or maybe they're cheap or maybe they just don't want the sales from my videos either way that did not stop today's artist from sending in something cool for the collection so on behalf of a new kind of fear we have a big box right here and I am excited to take a look at what's inside. So let's go ahead and not waste any more time. Let's jump right on into it and see what we've got. Now, as I mentioned, this came from a new kind of Fear Customs, which is the coolest name I think I've ever heard for a company. And obviously we all get the reference. Let's go ahead and see what a new kind of Fear has sent in. All right, so I opened the box upside down and he must have known that I was going to do that because right on the bottom, we have a certificate as well as some business cards. So let's check these out. Obviously we've got a Jason design there on the front kind of mixed with a gas mask. And then we've also got the company information there on the back. And then we've also got this certificate which says, a new kind of fear, certificate of authenticity. This is official certification that this custom item was made by a new kind of fear customs and is one of a kind. This piece was inspired by Friday the 13th part V11, which I believe is seven. Quick mess. The curse. And it's also signed by Topher Westcott, which is the leader of a new kind of fear customs. So let's see if my suspicions are correct. Now, when a new kind of fear hit me up, he said, hey, what's your style? So I went over to his Instagram page and I selected a few photos and videos and let him know exactly what my style was and something that we would definitely need for the Friday collection. So let's see what we've got. We've got the piece here and it's still bagged up nice and neat. Let's go ahead and untie it and take a look. Woo! Smells interesting. Looks fantastic. And of course, I'm gonna let you guys have the first look at it. I'm gonna do my best not to look in the flip screen of the camera. But from what I can tell, this thing is super, super dope. So now I'm gonna turn it around, take a look for myself. And yeah, that is pretty incredible. I will never, ever get tired of seeing a good Jason bust. We've got the clothing here, the eyes aren't cut yet, and this thing is just absolutely gorgeous. Wow, what a stellar piece. This might be the most quality piece to enter my Friday the 13th collection ever, and I am going on record and saying that. I believe that it is. Obviously, I'm gonna have to go out there and compare, but I'm pretty sure that this is probably the nicest Friday the 13th slash Jason related replica piece that we have. Look at that thing. Look at that eye. Oh, look at that, look at that. My God, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. So like I said, I thought it was a part seven mask and that's exactly what we got, but it's more so a bust for display, which is perfect because I don't plan on wearing this. Obviously, I don't have a very good Jason build, and even if I did, I'm just the type of dude that likes display and stuff. I don't really wear too many of my masks, which people really find strange, but whatever. That's a topic for a different video. A new kind of Fear Customs, part seven Jason, absolutely killer. Man, I just, 
I don't even know what to say about this. It's just gorgeous, man. The detail on this is absolutely fantastic, especially for the fact that it is all latex. A lot of this stuff looks like it is acrylic. It looks like we have acrylic modeled eyes. It looks like we have acrylic teeth but this is all latex. It's just finished that well. I'm also a big fan of the weathering that was done to the suit. As you can see, looking nice and dirty and torn up and very, very authentic. And I've gotta say something about the presentation here. It's not every company that will give you guys a certificate, which I find amazing. And just one more piece to add to a display to kind of make everything look that much cleaner or that much more professional. That's a good word for it. So yeah, huge shouts to a new kind of Fear Customs. Obviously, I will be dropping their information down below and I would love for you guys to go check them out. Drop by, show them some love, maybe even buy something and let them know that the House of Masks sent you, and maybe Topher will keep hooking us up with cool stuff in the future. As for right now, I really don't have too much to say about this piece. Stuff like this, I like to let speak for itself. I'm just gonna shut up, show this thing off, and that will make for today's video. So obviously, we're gonna end this video the same way that we end all of the rest of the unboxings and reviews on this channel with some nice up-close shots of this piece to let you guys see all of the detail. And trust me, there is plenty of detail to see on this thing. We're gonna find a place for it in the collection and show it off there as well and that will be that so one last huge thank you to a new kind of fear i definitely appreciate this thing it will have a happy forever home here at the house of masks and pale fest is coming up on october 8th 2022, so it's going to be admired by a lot of people here in person. Like I said, I'll be dropping a new kind of fears information down below in the description of this video. Make sure to go check them out. Thank you guys very, very much for watching. I really hope that you have enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and leave me a thumbs up down below. That lets me know that you're enjoying the content, and it also helps the channel out. It's a win-win. So until next time, this has been AJ Good here at the House of Masks telling you to say no to drugs and alcohol, and yes to a new new kind of fear, and we'll see you guys in the next one. Yeah! Hello? Yeah, hi, my name is Mark Tom. Yeah!
Yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'm calling you. Yeah, you're calling me. From the Global Reverse Mortgage Company. Yeah, you're calling me. Yeah. Huh? I'm a 14 year old girl. Sir, I know you're a male and are you the owner of the house or not? I just told you I'm a 14 year old girl. What part of that did you not understand? Sir, you don't sound like a girl. Okay, well that sounds pretty uh, pretty judgmental of you. Maybe I have a medical condition that makes my voice low. Sir, 